The last time I received a message from my grandma was Friday, the 19th of July, 2024. If ever there was a day when nobody else sent me a message, rest assured, my grandma would. Days go by where I go on my phone expecting to see a message from her, usually given back to another day or reminding me to enjoy life to the fullest. But as I open my WhatsApp, I'm suddenly struck by the reality that I will never receive a message like that from her again. My grandma was a woman who was filled with joy. Any occasion was a reason for celebration. Even to the extent that on mine or my mother's birthday, my grandma would invite her friends around and celebrate as if it were her birthday. My grandma also made sure to give me anything I wanted. One of my fondest memories are from when I was around seven or maybe eight. I had been begging my mom to let me get away to the extension I was on, and she never let me. As soon as we got to Ghana, it was time to do my hair, and my grandma was left with the responsibility of taking me. She asked me what style I wanted. I told her and she made it happen for me. I'm not sure what the conversation was between her and my mum after that, but from that day forth, my mum finally allowed me to get grace with extensions on a regular basis. The passing of my grandmother really hurt. As I sat on the page of Lana in July, it occurred to me that I didn't have a picture of us together. So I made it my mission to get one. I had it all kinds 
At least we could all tell the pain in the heart of the God. Thank you. 